Hey everyone, and welcome to the course. My name is Daniel Buckley, and I'll be instructor. So, in this course, we are going to look at augmented reality, and more specifically, uh, AR Foundation inside of Unity, and how to set that up so we can actually build our very own uh, AR app to our device. So, first of all, what we need to talk about is what exactly is augmented reality? Well, augmented reality uh, is basically adding virtual objects into the real world. This can be stuff such as 3D models, and maybe even measurements. Um, this is not to be confused with virtual reality. Uh, virtual reality is creating an entirely virtual uh, environment around you, whereas augmented reality is just augmenting your existing one. Now, AR technology is very versatile, as it can pretty much be used in any sort of field. It can be used in games, education, industry. As even now, there are a wide range of AR apps that cover a wide range of different uses. And something else you should also note is that augmented reality technology is fairly recent, um, and especially AR Foundation, which we're going to be working with. Uh, this sort of technology is new, and it is going to continue to grow as phone technology improves. So now, what is AR Foundation? Well, before we go into that, I reckon we should first talk about what the two main sort of AR SDKs that are out right now. Uh, the first one is AR Core. And this is augmented reality for Android devices. This allows developers to create uh, AR apps for Android devices. And then over on the iOS side, Apple has their AR kit, um, which has the same sort of principles with augmented reality, but with iOS devices. So what AR Foundation does is it gives the Unity developer an API um, so that they can actually develop for both platforms seamlessly. They don't have to have separate projects for uh, Android, one for iOS, they don't have to be switching between the different APIs and SDKs. Uh, it's all in one package where you can just develop for AR and then build to either iOS or Android or both. So how does AR Foundation actually work inside of Unity? Uh, well, first of all, what it does is it uses your camera and depth sensor. And with that, the app creates things known as feature points. These are basically points that are uh, points of interest in the world that it can track. It can track its position, uh, its orientation relative to other points as well. And this sort of maps out a rough 3D uh, sort of mesh of your world so that it understands how far away things are and the position between different feature points. Uh, and with this, the app can then create horizontal and vertical planes that map out real world surfaces. As you can see in the image, it can track the floor, it can track walls, and with this, we can do many things. The app can also track the device's position and orientation world space, so you can actually then walk around your environment, and in fact, it memorizes and catalogs the environment and feature points. So what you could do is you can go into an entirely different room, uh, look at around the walls there, set that up, and then go back into the other room, and all those feature points and objects that you placed down before will still actually be there. Okay, so that's how it works, but what can we actually do with AR Foundation? Why, why should we use it? Well, with AR Foundation, we can, first of all, of course, track surfaces, and with these surfaces, we can detect raycast hits and place objects. As you can see in the image to the left, um, there's objects that have been placed down on these surfaces, and they'll actually stick there, so you can walk around them, and they will stay in the exact same position. AR Foundation also has lighting estimation, which means that your AR models can actually adapt to the lighting around you. So if you're in a dark room, then your models will become darker. And if you're out in the sun, your models will be bright. And this is really good in creating immersive experiences as you don't want the lighting to be off. And of course, this technology will only get better as time goes on. Uh, there's also environment probes, and this allows you to accurately map the lighting conditions and reflections inside of your environment. So if you have a shiny object or something metallic, you can actually see your surrounding environment sort of reflect off of that object. AR Foundation also has face tracking, uh, so you can track people's faces and apply masks, really whatever you want, to their face. And then there is 2D image tracking. Uh, this is useful for maybe if you're maybe making a promotional app, you could have a movie poster or a game poster, and you could have your AR app look at it, and then out from that poster could pop a 3D model, an animation, or something like that. So with this collection of various different features, you can really make any sort of AR app you can think of at the moment. And of course, as time goes on, this technology is only going to get better, and there is definitely going to be many, many more features that are going to be added to AR Foundation and AR Core and AR Kit in the future for you to use. Now, on the screen here is a link that will actually take you to the AR Foundation uh, sort of manual page on the internet. 
This just goes over the features and sort of explains more about AR Foundation and how it works. Now, there is one sort of downside to AR Foundation, and that is not all devices are supported. Since this has fairly advanced AR in using uh, depth sensors and actually being able to capture, um, map out the world around you, it does require a certain level of device. So, first of all, for Android, you need a minimum Android version of 7.0. And all phones, including the Galaxy S7 and above, uh, can work with AR Foundation. And of course, all Pixel phones work as well. Uh, on the iOS side, uh, the support phones are the iPhone SE and the iPhone 6S and more recently. So pretty much all devices from the past few years should be working fine uh, with AR Foundation. But if you want to make sure, you can go to these following links, which will be down in the lesson summaries, to make sure that your specific device does actually work with AR Foundation. Zenva is an online learning academy with over 500,000 students. We feature a wide range of courses for people who are just starting out or for people who just want to learn something new. The courses are also very versatile, allowing you to learn in really whatever way you want. You can choose to follow the online video tutorials, or you can choose to read the included lesson summaries. There's even the included project files so you can follow along with the instructor. So now that we know a little bit more about AR and AR Foundation inside of Unity, let's now go and create our first AR app inside of Unity using AR Foundation.